This second screencast will review the directions for scripting and producing the video. You'll remember back in this section of the HyperDoc, you had several sources that you needed to explore and then generate different levels of questions with, for each of these sources. Now it's time to pare down those questions to the very few that you're going to be using for your research. So after watching the videos and exploring the links, determine you have four priority questions and list those four questions here that you would like to answer in research from the list you've generated. From the, these questions, and once you do your research, you're going to create a draft script for the video with information you have gathered to answer your priority questions. And here, there are roughly eight slides. They can certainly be more, but this is just sort of a framework for students to work from where they have an introductory sentence or phrase inviting the audience um, to the research that has been conducted by the student and design an introductory slide to do so. Slide two will be an introduction to your first question and etc. going down. Introduction to the second question, uh, insert a relevant image within the slideshow as well. And then the third question and the fourth question, uh, these questions should have a common thread that interrelates um, with, the, the, so they interrelate with each other where you're going to then form a conclusion from your research. And then the last slide would be future um, questions to consider. You're generating questions that may have come up during the research in addition to you're not only answering questions, but typically research generates more questions. From this framework and this slideshow, you're gonna choose a flat platform to create a video of your presentation or find one that works for you or one that you already have downloaded such as QuickTime. And here are some examples and some links to various video platforms that you can use.